Hey everybody, welcome back to World Drum Club. I'm Kalani Das, your host and teacher, and I'm so happy to have my friend Bahre Moktadai with us today. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for joining us. So Bahre and I met back in college uh, when we were both getting our degrees in music therapy. And the, the thing is, we're both, she's a music therapist, I'm a music therapist, but on this channel, um, I want you to know that Bahre is actually a world famous percussionist um, from Iran and now is international, you know, all over, travels all over, performs all over. And she brought uh, a traditional instrument from Iran. I'm just going to let her tell you all about it. So thanks for being here. Of course. Thanks for having me. So what do we have here? So this is uh, considered uh, principal percussion instruments uh, of uh, Persian music. And it's called tombak. Uh, T-O-N-B-A-K, that's how uh, we pronounce it, tombak. Mm. Some people pronounce it tombak with M, some people pronounce it with N, tombak. Mm. But uh, I would say the right one is tombak with N. Tombak. Tombak, yeah. Okay. Uh, but either or, you know, it doesn't really matter. But yeah. Uh, so basically, uh, yeah, it's a it's a Iranian's traditional percussion instrument. Uh, everything you see, it's natural, and um, it's beautiful. What, it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah the body is uh, is made by different kinds of woods, but mainly with either walnuts or berries. Or what? Berries, berries. Berries. Yes. What kind of berries? <laughs> <laughs> well, there is t there is one. Uh, I'm pretty sure that there's uh, a type that you don't find it in America. Mm, mm -hmm. It's called uh, toot. That's what it calls. And uh, they it's should the make one... trumpets out of that one. <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's the one that is more expensive uh -huh. and more, I would say, fragile. Mm -hmm. So you have to be really careful. Mm. Um, so this this particular one that I brought today uh, is made by walnut. Okay. Okay. And the head is either, is made by either uh, camel skin mm. or sheep. Okay. Okay. So that's pretty much about it. And... Uh, the way the the position uh, we normally place it on the lap, mm -hmm. but it has to be like um, you have to kind of try to find a place where is it won't move while you're playing. Mm -hmm. So it has to be stable. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, it will be playing uh, by basically by both palm and mostly by fingers. So all the ten fingers. Are moving. Mm. It's so, not like congas or bongos or even like jimbe's where you mainly uh, only play with your palm or mm. your um, tips. Mm -hmm. uh, it's it's all fingerings. It's a, it uh, it deals with a lot of rollings. Well, and stuff like that. And I'm sure people are dying <laughs> to hear what it sounds like. <laughs> And fortunately, you know, we have we have two cameras, right? So you guys are seeing the overhead view as well, which is the, well, the uh, the front view, so you get a little bit better view. But how about a, a, a sample? Um, sure. And then let's break it down into some individual tones, and you okay. can, we can talk about. But Absolutely. how about just yeah? You can play anything as a sample. Um, this uh, what I'm about to play now. It's one of uh, a popular. Persian rhythms, one two one two one two three one two one two one two three. It's uh, seven eight, um, and uh, this is how it sounds like.
something like that. Awesome. Um, yeah, and the the this uh, the Tomback basically plays both individually, both solos, mm. um, and uh, also it accompanies with other different kinds of both melodic instruments and other percussions mm -hmm. in uh, small ensembles or even in orchestras, like big orchestras. Um, and uh, you can, basically you can play any kind of rhythms. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, with, with the tone back, and what I usually do is that I would love to always challenge myself to accompany with like African, Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. music, you know, with uh, flamenco, Spanish, even jazz, blues, sure. you name yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so it varies a lot. There's a, uh, the di I like the diversity mm -hmm. um, of these instruments, and there are tons of things, tons of techniques you can play with. I, and I, I've heard some of your solos, and, and also you were accompanying a singer recently, right, on a tour. Yes. Uh, and other other musicians as yes. well. So what I what we can do is I'll get some links from Bahre, uh, and I will leave them down below this video. So make sure you check the comments, and we'll leave some links to some of her videos so you can um, when we're done here you can watch those and see. And also, um, do you have what's your online? How do people find you online? Mainly. Uh, well, I have a website. Uh, it's bahremt.com. Okay. I'm also in other. I'm on. I'm on Facebook. I'm on LinkedIn. I'm in so many all other. All the other stuff. Yeah. Instagram. Uh, I have. Uh, if you wanna search, if you wanna follow my page on Instagram, it's Mind and Music Therapy. That's what it calls. Oh great. Um and yeah, you can pretty much find me everywhere. <laughs> and uh, yeah, yeah, and there are some singles I, I have. Uh, I have some singles that I uploaded on SoundCloud um, and Spotify, and you can also find it on, <clears throat> excuse me, iTunes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, it it goes by the name of Sarab, S A R A B. Okay. Yeah. Great. I think so. What we're gonna do is we'll do a follow up uh, video with techniques because I want I want her to share some of the techniques. I don't even know what she was doing just there in the solo. I couldn't follow. Her fingers were like a blur to me. So, <laughs> <laughs> but we're gonna have, um, so Bahari's gonna share some basics, you know, so those of you who are curious or you wanna get started on Tonbach, um, you, could, you could learn a couple techniques, but we're gonna do that in a separate video. So we're gonna wrap this one up here. And of course for patrons, we're gonna give you a, a little bonus lesson over at patreon.com slash Kalani, which is a World Drum Club homepage. But thanks, Bahre, and we're gonna we're gonna continue. So look for part the next part, you know, basic Tonbach technique with Bahre. Thanks a lot. Thanks for having me. <laughs>